If you have cataract, that is, the, so your uh, eye doctor would like to do a few investigations which usually include a dilated examination of uh, the eye to do know thoroughly what is the reason for your diminished vision or uh, other investigations are also like an A scan. A scan is basically to know the power of the lens which will be implanted into your eyes. B scan is another scan which we commonly do to know the status of your retina before the surgery. And uh, depending on your eye conditions, uh, your doctor might go in for a few more scans or investigations. Routine blood investigations are also important uh, before going in for surgery. Now coming to the treatment options uh, which we have for cataract. Uh, previously, one of the first surgeries or predominant surgeries which is done even now in a rural setup is a small incision cataract surgery. Though a good procedure, it has its uh, disadvantages or setbacks, mainly being uh, you have to do this under anesthesia as in uh, give an injection to the patient locally uh, before going in for the procedure. The incision is also large. Some kind of blood loss is expected. There might be pain. Recovery or uh, patient going back to their routine day-to-day uh, -day, uh, activities is a little delayed. Also, your uh, doctor might need to suture that wound. These are the disadvantages which would come with a small incision cataract surgery. To avoid all this, recent advances have brought us procedure which is called phaco emulsification which has revolutionized uh, cataract uh, treatment as a layman term it uh, as a robotic keyhole surgery. So the advantages of this uh, surgery are it is painless. We just do it under topical anesthesia where we put eye drops on the eye so that there is a numbing effect and go in for the surgery. Procedure usually takes uh, not more than uh, 15 to 20 minutes. It is painless. It is bloodless. There is no blood loss here and the incision is very small usually about 2.2 to 2.8 uh, mm. So through this, uh, we go into the eye and melt the uh, cataractus lens where it is. So we don't generally tend to remove the cataract. So we just melt it where is as is. And then through the same incision, we place an in, uh, implantable uh, intraocular lens, a foldable lens inside the eye. The main advantage of this is almost immediate uh, post-op recovery. Patient can get back to their day-to-day uh, -day activities. They can resume their uh, normal life soon. Types of the lens which is implanted into your eye is a totally something which you should take up with your doctor and you can sit across the table and have a discussion. There are many types of lenses depending on your day-to-day -day lifestyle. Basically, as a broad variation, we have monofocal lenses wherein patients will need to uh, wear spectacles after the surgery or we have multifocal lenses wherein the need uh, to use glasses after the surgery is totally elevated. This surgery is usually a daycare procedure. It is very safe to undergo, very easy to undergo and uh, uh, complications are next to nothing. In case you are suffering from any of these uh, previously mentioned symptoms, uh, we suggest uh, you to come down to the Erit Hospital and get your eyes checked. Thank you.